Olivia! us, Reuben. So much of it has already been reduced to bedrock, and it's up to us to save the rest of it. Well, maybe that is a lot of pressure for just a person and a pig, but we have to find a way. That's what I said, isn't it? Oh, just as you once helped us before. This isn't about the past, it's about the future. There are three of those things now. You say that like it's my fault. It is your fault. Oh, take responsibility for once, Soren. I did that. Soren, you need to listen to me. Oh, what good has ever come of that? What are you doing here, Ivor? Come to lock me in another room? I came to offer my help. Ha! <laughs> He's been following us. It's not like that. You need to hear me out. What you don't understand is, you are all in very grave danger. <laughs> Obviously! No, I mean specifically this group. The Witherstorm isn't acting randomly. It's following Gabriel. Gabriel? You see, I may have programmed it to follow his amulet. You mean the Order's amulet? Yes, Sora. That amulet. Did you also know I was the one he gave the amulet to? What? I... I didn't know. Ah, Ivor, you fool. You've created a monster that's following Jesse, and it's only getting stronger. You don't think I realize that? Nothing can stop those things. Nothing even hurts them. Well, except Enderman. Enderman? Jesse's right. Withers' gaze passed over them, and they went wild. We actually just saw a bunch of Endermen pull blocks off a Witherstorm. So... So, enough of them working together might be able to destroy a Witherstorm entirely. It's a promising concept, at least in theory. But to actually destroy a Witherstorm, we'd need hundreds of them. There's probably more than enough of them taking refuge in my fortress. An unintended side effect of you flooding the end. This is just like the old days, Soren. You and your crazy ideas- Hush, Ivor, for once! Huh. Question is, how to bring the Storms and the Endermen together? Endermen aren't pets. They don't follow orders. At least, not for mere mortals. The Witherstorms are already chasing us. If we just get them to chase us to your fortress again- Yes! Yes, that's it! They'll be caught between a rock and a hard place! If we can't bring the Endermen to the Witherstorms, we bring the Witherstorms to the Endermen. Just one problem. You're forgetting about the command block! Ugh, oh, yes. It's clear now that no weapon can destroy it. Not even a formidable. Actually, I may have a solution to that. You see, when I first took possession of the command block... You mean, stole it? Yes, well, I created a failsafe. A backup plan, just in case. Well, I'd say just in case is here. Ivor, how could you keep this secret? Oh, believe you me, keeping secrets is easy. So I made something. An enchanting book. One that contains the power of the command block itself. Use it to enchant a weapon and you'll be able to smash the command block to bits. Forever! Yes. Yes, that's it! It could very well solve all our problems. 
What are we waiting for? Let's go get that book. Just one problem. It's at my secret lab, which is sort of far away. How far could it possibly be? Let's just say it's the farthest place a person can travel before being utterly... Oh dear, what was that? it found us so quickly. We're not safe anywhere, are we? Well, we can't stand around and wait for it. Guys, there's a reason it's been following us. Ivor says it's because of the amulet that Gabriel... Ivor! It is you! Good to see you too, Magnus. Hello. My name is Gabriel. Somebody pinch me. Anyway, Ivor's figured out that Witherstorms are drawn to the amulet, so we're gonna lure them back to Soren's fortress and destroy the command block with an enchanted superweapon. You figured all that out just now? The point is we need to get moving. We aren't safe. Not as long as we have that amulet. I'll take it. You can't. I can, and I have to. But you could be killed. There's no way I can let you do that, Axel. You don't understand. I'm not asking. I thought you'd trust me by now. You just go make that super weapon. I'll meet you back at Soren's fortress. Well, Axel shouldn't have to do this alone. I'm coming with you, man. Nice. Jesse, I'm going with him, too. Like you said, I need to keep fighting. Well... I'm going with Jesse. I, I pledge to help, and that's what I must do. My friends are still out there somewhere, and you must do this for them. Well, never thought I'd be saying this, but Ivor, lead the way. Hey, Jesse, let's try our handshake again, just once for the road. The builder bump? You got it. Oh well. Real heroes don't need handshakes anyway. I'll see you at Soren's, alright? Not if I see you first. Too much further. It's really not necessary. I'm just trying to be encouraging.
No! No, we're not even close! end is profoundly sore. Huh. I feel like we've been riding forever. I am telling you, we cannot go to the Far Lands. They're not just the edge of our world, but the limits of our comprehension. Oh, please. The Far Lands are a happy accident. Nature's way of keeping life interesting. No, no, no. They are perilous and unpredictable. Perlin noise, floating points. These are not matters to be toyed with. Why are you so down on the Far Lands, Soren? They sound cool. See? Jesse thinks the Far Lands are cool. The Far Lands lie at the very edge of all things, where logic gives way to chaos. They're a dangerous place to visit, and a ridiculous place to construct a laboratory. <laughs> Just wait until you see it. Do those two never stop arguing? I don't know. I'm too hungry to care. Yeah, I'm starving. We all are. Maybe we should turn back? This isn't the time. Swamps are too dangerous. You never know what might be lurking around. What was that? My stomach. Let's look around, see what we could find out. We mustn't linger long. The Far Lands are just beyond this swamp. So this could be our last chance to find food? <laughs> Jesse, have you found any food? I think I saw some potatoes back there. A witch's hut. Yeah! We should steer clear of it. Nothing good ever happens when witches are involved. Look, a cake! That's... that's enough to feed everyone! It isn't worth it, Jesse. Witches hate trespassers. Besides, there are plenty of potatoes around. Is that a witch? Jesse, we shouldn't be here. Witches are very strong. Ivor, I can't pass this up. I need you to watch my back, okay? I'm telling you, this is a bad idea. Just be quick about it. A potion of leaping. Cool. An entire cake. Nice. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Ivor! Ivor? Jesse! Help us! Hey! You! Witch! Everyone, let's get out of here ASAP! Ivor said the Far Lands are just past the swamp. Wait! Where is Ivor? What? I thought he was with you. I don't know. He disappeared outside the witch's hut. Curse that fool of a man. Come on! Guys, I 
think we lost them for... Wow! I see your wow and raise you a whoa. It's like we're at the edge of the world. Actually, we seem to be at the corner of it. Welcome to the Far Lands, my friend. I'm glad Jesse snagged this cake. Makes the whole wall of insanity thing a lot easier to face. Say what you like about witches. They sure know how to make a cake. Hmm. Quite a sight, isn't it? Stretching skyward in all its glory. This wall. Did Ivor build this? No, of course not. This is a natural phenomenon intersection of two of the great walls that form the boundary of our world. Incredible. You can say that again. How can Ivor live here? I mean, it's one thing to build a wall world inside the end, but this... Oh, I doubt he lives here. He most likely comes here only for his most secretive research. Whatever Ivor is hiding in here, it will be extremely well guarded. This way, I suspect. I'd feel better about this if Axel and Petra were here. I know what you mean. Come on! Would appear so. A massive one from the looks of it. If Ivor used the command block to build this, it could hold unspeakable peril. So, maybe we should not just wander into the world's hardest maze without a guide. Unfortunately, this seems to be the only way forward. There has to be another way. A secret door, or I don't know. There's no way we're going into some crazy maze that I were built to keep people away. We'll find some other way through. Best decision you've made all day. Everyone, on guard! There's too many! We can't fight them all! <sighs> Guys, caught in the vines! Well, that worked, I suppose. Yeah, I guess. Yeah, but now what? We're all separated. Let's just head that way and find a place where the pads connect. Sure hope they don't get lost in there. I hope I don't get lost in there.
Hey, that must be Ivor's lab. Wish it was a little closer. Yikes! Shoot! You have got to be kidding me. Olivia! see a way across. Looks like Ivor kept some redstone dust handy. And a slime ball. Huh, redstone blocks, some pistons. I wonder what this thing's supposed to be. Hello? Anyone? Olivia, is that you? Jesse, there you are. <coughs> I thought I'd never find you. Any sign of the others? Not yet. This maze? 
We don't have time for this. Who even knows where the others are by now? I mean, the clock's ticking here, Jesse. Yet we're lost in some elaborate puzzle. Well, at least we're back together. Yes, the Dream Team reunited. <laughs> now the Dream Team's just gotta find a way across this gaping bottomless pit. What about this thing? Could it get us across? It's some kind of flying barge. It would probably get us to the other side. But it's in really bad shape. And it's really complicated. You can fix it though, right? I don't know. I think it's out of my league. I wish I'd had more time to study with Eligard. She could have fixed this thing right up. Come on, you'll figure it out. You know you always do. <sighs> Fine. I'll take a look. This layout doesn't even make any sense. What was Ivor thinking? Or maybe it's just me. I mean, Eligard herself said I don't have what it takes to be a great engineer. She was right. I just can't hack it. So prove her wrong. Show the world what you're made of. Prove her wrong? Jesse, she was the greatest Redstone engineer ever. She was in the Order of the Stone. Sure, but the Order are still people, just like us. Right. Just like us. I mean, how are we the ones saving the world when even they don't have what it takes? Soren and Ivor are always at each other's throats. The greatest warrior in history doesn't remember his own name. All I ever see Magnus do is argue, and we both know what happened to Eligard. If the Order can't do this, how are we supposed to? How are we supposed to do anything? You know what? We're better than them. Better than the Order? I don't know about that. I mean, they defeated an Ender Dragon. Can you name even one thing we've done right? And I don't mean managing to stay alive. Well, for starters, we're the ones who brought them back together again. You found Eligard, I found Magnus. We both played a role with Soren. Yeah, I suppose that's true. Ah, all right. I'll try it one more time. Wait a second. I think I see what he was trying to do. Jesse, take this piston, craft it into a sticky piston, then place it on the other side of the barge, along with a redstone block. You got all that? I think so. 